It's Bonnie. Happy Sunday. I am back. Oh my goodness. It is cold out and I am saying no to cold and I put my tank top on. I just did it. <laughs> Feeling very tropical here. So this morning uh, I went grocery shopping again because I forgot a whole bunch of stuff the other day and uh, I almost stopped at Bath and Body Works and then I'm like, you know what? I've got so much to do. I'm just going to come home. So I came home and uh, we start reviewing. I got a lot to talk about today. So pink pineapple sunrise. Oh my goodness. This is actually one of my favorite suns to talk about. Actually, do I have last year's? I do. I got it. Check it out. Pink pineapple sunrise showed up last year at Bath and Body Works for the first time. This was kind of like an exciting new scent. Um, for last year. A lot of people really loved it. So it was no surprise that they brought it back. So here's the difference in packaging style. I personally love this one so much more, um, but they're both pretty. I mean, I got to say they, they both work, but I kind of like the flashy one a little better. <laughs> so Pink Pineapple Sunrise um, is in the same collection as the Watermelon Mojito. Golden Mango Lagoon, Coconut Pineapple, and Fresh Jungle Rain. I'm kind of wondering if they're going to bring out maybe like another one. Sometimes that happens. Like they'll add something in. The other weird thing is I'm seeing um, Bahamas Passion Fruit and Banana Flower in like a light pink faceted as part of a gift collection. And then there's another Bahamas with like a tropical um, packaging. So I'm going to try and find those just to at least get a picture because I think we have a little, a little Scooby-Doo mystery going on here, a little confusion. <laughs> so Pink Pineapple Sunrise is Sweet Pink Pineapple, Palm Sugar, and Sun Drenched Nectar. So we have pineapple, we have sugar, and we have nectar. So what does all that mean? It means it's sugary. <laughs> it means it's like a super sugary combination. The only weird thing about um, the Tropical Collection is they put this like green lid on every single um fragrance and it just it doesn't go too good with all of them i don't know it looks good on a few of them but it's kind of interesting um i think a gold lid actually would have looked a little bit better because it would have matched uh the band here oh, i love pink pineapple sunrise uh it's sweet um it smells different than like the coconut pineapple because coconut pineapple is more of like a juicy pineapple, like fresh cut juicy pineapple. This one, um, and I don't, honestly, like, I don't think I've even eaten pink pineapple, but from what I'm hearing, it definitely has a lot more sugary sweetness quality to it. I need to get a pink pineapple. I had to try it, but I, I love the scent. Um, there's not a lot of, um, you know, floral, beachy, woodsy. There's like a hint Maybe like a hint, and I'm thinking that's the sun drenched nectar that's a little bit of like a summer vibe. A summer vibe is as far as I'm going to go. But mostly it's just sweet pink pineapple. I feel like it's got some lasting power. So pink pineapple sunrise is pretty much uh, the flagship of um, the five, the five tropicals, because we also have it in a gorgeous bar soap. Oh my gosh. I could actually try the bar soap. I like the toucan, by the way. That's really cute. You'd think they would have put like a pink flamingo on this one, but they put the toucan on there. <laughs> we have uh, the whip body butter, which is always good. I talked about the whip body butter the other day. It just smells so good. I like. I'm gonna be using this this summer. Um, we have it in the shower gel. I tried the shower gel last night. I'm like, I love the shower gel. It is super sweet and fruity in the shower gels. The shower gel is always more fruity than like the rest of the collection. It's kind of funny. Um, we have it in the cream. I used the cream last night. I love in the cream. Um, I feel like the creams are a little bit on the light side, a little bit on the light side this year. I, I heard that somewhere that Bath and Body Works is recommending you layer like the cream in the mist. I'm kind of thinking you got to do that in order to get like the full scent going on. And then um, we have the moisturizing body wash, which I love. It's funny. I've been, I've been using this a lot more this spring. I don't know why. I've just been kind of gravitating towards moisturizing body wash. That's not quite as fruity as the gel for some reason. I don't know why. Um, the main difference between the two is that this is more moisturizing quality. Um, and then you can use this as bubble bath. I've used this as bubble bath a lot. Just pour it in. You get some bubbles. It works great. 
Um, and then, of course, we have a pocket back. We have, you know, I pulled everything on my screen here. Um, oh, we have a bath fizzy. If these go on sale, I'll probably do a demo of the bath fizzy. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys, it's in the car. The moisturizing hand sanitizer. I love it. Oh my gosh. I've been using that like almost constantly since I put it in my car. And it's funny because I put Pink Pineapple Sunrise in the car and I put Beautiful Day in the car and I'm using Pink Pineapple Sunrise and my mother's like, that stinks. <laughs> I love the way it stinks. <laughs> and she's like, the Beautiful Day is really nice, but your Pink Pineapple Sunrise stinks. I'm like, okay, fine. <laughs> I'm just laughing. So my mom didn't like that one. Um, and then we have it in the hand sanitizer spray. We have it in... Wait, where's my... I don't know where I put my hands up. It's in the other room. Uh, we have it in the ham soap. Oh, we do have it. Okay, online. I got to show you guys this. So it is in the faceted in the gift pack. I'm going to put a screenshot up right here so that you can see this. I think this looks like the um, the packaging from last year. Um, I'm hearing Bahamas is in a light pink. I got to look that up. That's really interesting. It's in the hand cream. And then we also have it in an exfoliating beach body scrub. So this is going to be the sand scrub, I think. So I have to do a review of the sand scrub. It's super exfoliating. It's a little bit on the messy side, but I'll do a sync demo of that once I get it. And then of course we have it in the candle. Oh, I love it in the candle. This is a white wax this year. I love the basket weave and the gold on top. Um, just really, is that basket weave? Kind of looks like it. Uh, this looks so dry. I love the candle. I love the candle. It's so pretty. So overall, um, Pink Pineapple Sunrise is definitely one of my favorites in the Tropical Collection. I wear it every year. I keep it on my dresser all through summer. Um, I usually put it away maybe like beginning of August, but I do. I like I like to wear it maybe once or twice a week. I, I, I switch off scents so much. Like sometimes in the morning, I'll do like Pink Pineapple Sunrise and then I'll switch to Watermelon Mojito in the afternoon. I'm always switching fragrances, so I keep a lot of them out. But this is a good one. If you like a nice, sweet pink pineapple, I would try this one. It's a good one. Uh, today we still have the candle sale going on. And um, we also have the two free gifts. So if you're looking to get something to buy three, get three is also today. Layer the sales, use the code coconut, and then you get the, um, the Cocoa Paradise in the cream and the mist, and you get yourself two extra body care, uh, which is kind of a big deal because I'm going to do the math on this and show you uh, what I'm talking about here. So if you were to get... Um, I'm going to go with the least expensive, $13.50. $13.50 for the shower gels because you like the shower gels you want to stock up. $13.50 uh, times three, you're going to pay $40.50 for six of them. But then you get the two free. You get the mist and the cream. So instead of dividing it by six, I'm going to divide it by eight. It's going to come out to $5.06 per product. You don't realize until you do the math how low that price point is. So that's something to think about. Even if you do uh, a more expensive product like the cream, I'm going to do $16.95 times three. Uh, that's going to be $50.80 divided by eight, six thirty-five. dollars Still not bad. So it's kind of like getting a body care day sale um, when you get those two products for free. So I thought I'd bring that up. Anyway, let me know what you think of Pink Pineapple Sunrise. I will be back in a little bit. Bye-bye.